Hello everyone and welcome back to Elden Ring. In the last session, we have continued on Rani's questline and it has taken us to a new section. Whoa, that zoomed in. It has taken us to a new section of the Ainsel River, which we have not been able to reach before. And wait, am I pointing? Oh, right. My character's pointing that way. My camera was pointing this way. So yeah, this is down that way. Yeah, okay. Good. Good. That was what I was thinking. Um, and yeah, I'm very excited to continue going. We have got a lot of threads we can pull on right now. We're, we're continuing with Rani for the moment. We've got uh, all the way over here. We've got all this stuff going on, which we got a decent way into. And then I just really wanted to see what was going to happen with Rani. So we went back there, but we will be back here. And we've also got something to do with this, uh, this tower here, which we can now access, which we couldn't before. So we need to do that. I also remembered that... Uh, way back when we were in Celia, which is uh, here, yes, uh, we opened two big doors when we lit all three things, and we went up one, which led us to uh, someone, Millicent, uh, at the Church of the Plague, and then we went on Millicent's journey, and I completely forgot to go through the other big door that got unlocked, like right next to it, so we need to do that as well, there's just so many things, so many things, man. Uh, Let's just remind ourselves what Rani said. Perform for me a service as recompense. Eliminate the baleful shadows which prowl these lands. Right, yes. The name of Rani the Witch is already sullied by thee. I will not brook disobedience in this matter. You got it. Is that it? Nothing Perform else? Perform for me yeah. a service. Eliminate the, ba the name of Rani the Witch. I will not. Cool. Um... And we're not close to a level, are we? Oh my god, it's 50,000 souls! I had forgotten. Cool. Do I have any of these? No. No. It's been a while. We are definitely, uh... Definitely in the part of the game where we have a lot less of those appearing, it seems. Right, so, first up is this friendly chap. Uh... How do you zoom in on that again like that? Yeah. We fought this guy a couple times. And he just like spews boulders at you. Hello, friends. Spews the gravity boulders at you. But this one looks like we just have to kind of run straight up to him. I wonder how long it'll take for him to spot me. Well, that's rude. Man, they're all, like, goopy. Oh, God, you take no damage. Am I not supposed to be here yet? <laughs> Unsure. Be wary of unfathomable sort. Yes. I am very wary of the unfathomable sort over there. Ul Palace Ruins. Right, yeah. This is... We've been to a different part of the Ul Palace Ruins. These are Ul Palace Ruins. And these are also Ul Palace Ruins. So the Ul Palace was a pretty big fucking joint. Or multiple separate joints, I guess. I, I don't know what the landscape might have been back when the Ul Palace was a big deal. Also, oh my god, look at those statues. Hello. Very interesting, very interesting. Are you not gonna... Okay, if you're not gonna come to me, that's fine. I feel like I should probably deal with this big boy first. Is he low enough? He's low enough to the ground that I can just get hits on him, right? We can get behind here. I forget, how much does gravity magic do to him? Not much when it misses. Oh, that's pretty, pretty nice. Oh, 
Uh oh. Oh! Fucked him. I hate that fucking pincer, man. That fucking pincer is nasty. I, I, I know I've, like, just stabbed one to death before. But, uh, I'd rather do it with the magic if possible. Because they're a one time kill. Oh, that's interesting. You can fuck him out of it, like, halfway through the process. Fuck out of here. Oh, shit. I said, fuck out of here. Oh, 8,000 souls out of that. That's pretty... Oh, and a somber smithing stone. Not bad. Try behind. Cheeky glove warts. Very nice, very nice. Won't turn them down. Golden Rune 7. Cheeky. Come on. Just turns into a big pile of sludge. Human bone shard. Man, yeah, look at these. Is this... Is this Mr. Ool himself? The Ool Palace Ruins? It's still so interesting to me that these are the Ool Palace Ruins. And above ground, like here-ish... It doesn't say it as the Grace Point name, but these were the old Duh Palace Ruins, with a D. These are the Ool. It's like, it means something. They are almost identical above and below ground, but just slightly different. Why? Why is that? Why is that the case? Fucking sick ass statue though. What's he clutching? What's the, what's the stone that he's holding onto? It also looks like there's roots. It's either tentacles, but I'm inclined to think it's like Erd tree roots, perhaps, coming out of him or something. Very interesting. Alright, mate. Cute. That's such a pretty spell. I love it. Ow. I'd never use it. Because it's fucking shit, you know? But, like, <laughs> it's pretty. Points for pretty. Damn. I don't believe it ahead. What? Flower? There's a flower down there. What is that? Can I get Horsey out in here? No. Hmm. I wonder why. It's like it's a big enough area. Hmm. Oh, hi. A few of you, huh? Whoa. 
What are you doing? What's he doing with that spinny thing? Is that just... I guess... That, oh, no! He's gonna yeet it! Okay. Oh, my goodness. How about you don't yeet it? How about that? Ever thought of that idea? I love that idea. Oh, you're still alive. <laughs> I thought they were both dead. Whoopsie. Now, is this death? Water side, oh, water side. Didn't expect water side. Is it not death? It looks really steep. Bravery required ahead? I think that's one way. I'd are they supposed to be saying water slide? I feel like that's a one-way trip. How the fuck do you jump up onto this? Oh, just like that. Wow, I was really making it too difficult. What the fuck is this? Golden centipede? Have I seen that? I guess I have seen that before because it didn't come up as a new thing, but... I also forgot to look where it went in my inventory. Ah, there. Four. Found near churches and similar. Interesting. The old palace had some religious aspect to it then. Kept as a fetish by Golden Order fundamentalists, especially the hunters of those who live in death. Right, now that I read that again, I remember I did read it before. Because I remember going, that's an interesting uh, use of the word fetish. Accurate. Just uh, <laughs> fetish tends to mean something different these days. Interesting to see how language evolves. Shit. There's so many of these motherfuckers and they have so much health. Let me kill you, man. Man, imagine having 30k souls and still being 20k away from a level. You hate to see it. You really do hate to see it. Golden Rune 7. Tasty. Tasty. Delectable. Smithing Stone 4. Right ahead in short seek skill. Right ahead. Water flowing into this way. I thought maybe it would be a hidden doodah. Now, what the fuck is this? Is this madness? Oh, hello. I think this is probably madness. I can't think of anything else that would be that yellow. We have had our shit refilled, so can I, like... Oh, God. That is a healthy boy. Okay, madness. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Oh! Did I just get madness just for hitting him? Well, I mean, obviously we're going to run out of magic. Okay, I did not get madness just for hitting him. Uh, 
That's a lot of fucking madness, though. <laughs> that is an absolute madness. Oh, that was too close. That is what we in the biz call too close. You know what? Do I have any? Uh, do I have any of the things that get rid of madness? Uh, poison. Oh fuck! Poison, scarlet rot, blood loss, death blight. No. And I can't craft any because you can't craft in fights. Oh well. Okay, good. Yo! Okay, that was a sudden... Okay, so, oh, okay. Madness doesn't do damage over time? I thought it did. Never mind. I guess that was less scary than I thought. If I can bait... Uh, obviously, we need to wait for that to go away. But if I can bait him to do a, a light, shiny, down on my head attack, then I can run in and get the final blows. But obviously, it won't work if the madness is still in the air. I can feel the madness in the air tonight. Oh lord. Right, do your, do your shooty spinny thing. That's great, thank you. Perfect. What do I get for my troubles? Fucking nothing. Sick. Sick. Stone Sword Key, though. I'll definitely take that. Never. Never enough Stone Sword Keys. Not bad, not bad. Pretty fast. Love what six? Okay, is this just a dead end down here, or is there actually anything? I mean, I'm not jumping off that. <laughs> Be wary of liar, right? Yeah. That is definitely death. Oh, hello. Almost missed this though. Clayman ashes. That's what these guys are. These are clay men. Interesting. Clay implies. They were created rather than, like, transformed or something. Uh, spirits of two clay men. Bowed with age or bowed with age. These spirits are sluggish but hard to stagger, I noticed. The warped remains of priests. Never mind, they were transformed. Well, sort of. The warped remains of priests who search for revelation in service of the ancient dynasty. They employ two sorceries that produce smaller and larger bubbles. So there's the golden centipede connection. These guys were priests. Interesting. They searched for revelation in service of the ancient dynasty. So I'm guessing this is going to be a dynasty that predates, like, the Erd Tree, predates the Shattering. Well, Erd Tree's before Shattering, so obviously, but yeah. This, this seems like really old shit. The before times. <laughs> I don't know. That's the vibe I'm getting. Cool, cool. Okay, well, I don't think there's anything more down this way, which would mean it's time to go that way. Uh, can I... Man, I don't know if I want to go... I mean, I've got these. I should probably go and level, right? Because that looks pretty one way. And I'm not sure I'm vibing it. Seven... Oh, we can upgrade our fucking boy, can't we? I forgot about that. I upgraded our boy up to the point where we were still... We still had plenty of the things left. 
And then we got to ones that I only had like one of, and so I stopped upgrading him then in case he was shit. Turns out he's really good. Turns out he's my friend. So I should uh, I should definitely upgrade him more. I mean, not that he really needs it. He's fucking sick anyway, but... We'll get to it. So many things to do. So many things to do. So much to do, so much to see. Gotta upgrade the copy of me. Right, how much do I fucking need again? Uh, 51 and a half. Okay, so we need another, like, 4k. Uh, what's 4k gonna be? Are you gonna be a 4 banger? No, you are decidedly not a 4 banger. Now we need a 3 banger. Uh, that was a six. That was a five. What about you? Okay. Now we need a one banger. <laughs> uh, that's 500, right? Is that like... I can't remember if that's 750 or 1,000. Let's just pop a three. That'll be enough. Narrator. It was not enough. Or wait, was it? Shit. Wait, no, the first- no, what am I thinking about? The first one isn't 500, the first one's 200. There we go. We got there eventually. Just gotta engage the old brain. Boom. On our way to the fat, girthy, chonky, chonky 50 vigor. Hello, everyone. It is very kind of them to not respawn big, big floaty McGee, Mr. Float. They do respawn the um, flower. Sup, friends. Don't mind me, just going down the rabbit hole here. Where am I on the map right now? Oh, I can't open it. Oh, I know where I am on the map. Oh, fucking more fucking... No! Was that death blight? Maybe not. It looks black as fucking pitch, but maybe that's just the lighting. My goodness! <laughs> Everywhere I go, I can't get away from these fuckers. Are you actually following me, like, all the way, or... Whoa, camera, hello? You're just gonna... Ooh, stimulating boluses. Never seen that before. Apparently, it is. Alleviates buildup of sleep. Causing, su causing sudden fogginess and loss of FP once the threshold is re reached. Even if it does not force the afflicted into true slumber. I wonder what the fogginess is. Like, obviously... I can grasp what loss of FP means. Not entirely sure what fogginess would entail. I can't believe. I can't believe we got out of the fucking... Below Lane Dell bit. What was that called again? Deep Root Depths. That's the one. And there's more of them. <laughs> there's more of them. And there's fucking eggs and shit. Ugh. Disgusting. Grim. Whoa, what the fuck is this? That's a big boy. Oh my god, I guess I'll fucking die then, shall I? Because I can't move, because I'm fucking stuck on your pissing babies. Fuck yourself. They were a lot less scary in the depths because I had horsey. I mean, they were still pretty scary, but like, horsey enables instant getting out of fucking shit situations like that. Man, this run's a little bit of a fucking pain in the ass, isn't it? <laughs> it's like, there's no difficulty to it. You've just got to run a really long way in a straight fucking line. Oh, boy. 
I can't wait to do this over and over again. I can't wait to do this over and over again. I can't wait, no, I can't wait, I can't wait to do this over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. Right, fucker. Shit. What was that? It's like... It's instant damage, but it wasn't building up a status effect, so I don't actually know. Plus side, I have FP. I forgot about that. Now you come to fucking me. None of this me coming to you shit. Fuck that noise. You get yourself right on over here. Or don't. That's also a valid response. Okay. Okay. Good. Nothing coming up behind me. Okay, let's just... That's fine. One is all we need. We just need to pull him away from that prick. It's the 2v1s that I'm not all about. Not loving life when a 2v1's on. Alright. Golden Ring 10? Fuck yeah. Uh, now, is there any... Are there going to be any coming down from the ceiling? Or can I just, like, engage without fear? I am the man without fear! I have fear! I have discovered fear. I, and I, it, it hurts. Bruh, let me get behind this fucking head of yours. You fat head. Get fucked on. That's my favorite move, that. Use it all the time. Shield Grease. Solidified Grease made from a mixture of magically resonant materials. Boosts guarding ability and all forms of damage negation. Eh. Sounds interesting. Right. We have ourselves a cheeky choicey. Left or right. Well, these guys probably respawn. So I'm going to go left first. Because right, I can probably just run past them. But left. Hello. Could this be a god? Oh, I know where this is going to be. I know where this is going to be. Yeah! I fucking instantly knew. Oh! Now, you're not like the others. You don't have the fucking resist to my slash. Like, you take way more damage. And you use gravity magic. And I guess they were worshipping the fucking boy who was hanging down here, but I already killed him. So you would now have to deal with another one. If you hadn't already found your way down there. But me being fucking Mr. Thorough. <laughs> I've already I've already cleared that joint out. Fuck yeah. And then down that path down there leads to the other massive skeleton statue and the other Dragon King Gra Dragonkin soldier of Noxtella. Uh how the fuck do I get to you? Does that wrap I don't think that wraps up and around to there, does it? Does it? I mean, there's no other way that I'm seeing. Can't you get to there from the floor? No, I'm thinking of the one below it, I think. Yeah, no. Okay, good. Good. There's a chest. Hello? Hello? Love a cheeky chesty. But before we do that, let me not forget this ting.
Okay, that's fine. No complaints, no complaints from me. Now, love a chest. Big chest ahead and all that. Okay, it's not a legendary, it's only a blue. The Wing of Astal. Uh, shit, I didn't look. Was that a talisman? It's probably a talisman, right? Uh, fuck, was it not? Fuck, I just assumed it was a talisman and didn't actually look. Uh, it's not here. Was it a fucking key item? God damn it. What the fuck was it? <laughs> uh, I guess maybe it was a weapon? It didn't look... Oh, never mind. It totally is. Totally is. Strength E, Dex D, Int D. The Wing of Astal. Curved sword. Hmm. Sword fashioned from a delicate wing, suffused with the magic of the stars. Strong attack unleashes a wave of enchanted light. Crafted from a relic of the natural born of the void who is said to have assailed the eternal city. Unique skill, Nebula. Imbue the natural born's wings with magic to send forth a dark cloud of stars that lingers briefly before exploding. That sounds fucking dope. And fucking lore-wise. Relic of the natural born of the void? <laughs> Pardon? Who is said to have assailed the Eternal City. I'm pretty sure assailed is like assaulted, right? Like attacked, I think. I think, in fact, you know what? To the Google machine. To the Google machine. Let me just check that I'm reading, that I uh, that my definition of that word is correct. Assailed. Uh, Make a concerted or violent attack on. Yes, I am correct. Good. Love to not be wrong. My favorite thing. Um, so, why? Is, is the natural born of the void, is that, was that referring to, like, the thing that was just floating there? But, like, we've seen a bunch of them. Is that the third one we've seen, or is that the second one we've seen? There was one, obviously, in the other bit, which we just, which we're overlooking now, there was the one we just killed... Oh, that's why there was a third one in some fucking random cave somewhere that we couldn't reach. And he was just firing down on, like, a little ledge. Yeah. I can't remember which cave that was. And we never found a way to it. I thought maybe some other cave would lead to it, but we never found it. Hmm. But, yeah. Um, I wonder if it was working for the Greater Will. Because we know the Greater Will is the one that, like, uh, banished the, the Nox dudes down to the Eternal City, but then they didn't build the Eternal City, right? Or did they? No, I'm pretty sure they were banished down there, but like it was the the city itself was already there. Uh, what am I thinking of? Helmet? Helmet. I'm thinking of Helmet. Uh, the Nox invoked the ire of the Greater Will and were banished deep underground. Now they live under a false night sky. You know what? It doesn't actually make that clear. They might have created the Eternal City themselves, or they might have been banished to it and made it their home, but it already existed. I wonder. But either way, this void thing attacked the Eternal City. God, I fucking love the lore in this. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Right, um... I'm getting no way back vibes. Oh wait, no. Oh well. Now I'm getting really big no way back vibes. <laughs> fuck's sake. For fuck's sake. Okay. So. Bong. Now we head back down there and we go to the right. Right. 